Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you are noticing signs of slow performance, file corruptions, data loss, or errors while you are moving or copying files on your SSD, your solid state drive, or any hard drive for that matter, then just a quick video to show you in case you didn't know how to, to check your SSD or your hard drive um, using the built-in Windows scanner. Now, Obviously, there are third-party apps you can use to uh, do the job, but I'm just going to focus, as mentioned, using the tools already available in Windows 10 and Windows 11, like I like to do. And uh, um, if you are wanting to use the built-in scanner and maybe you've noticed some of those symptoms on your SSD or your hard drives, then what we need to do is head to our file explorer and head over to this PC and locate the drive that you are finding an issue with. Now, I'm just going to use my C drive or my main Windows drive, installation drive, for the purpose of today's video. And what we do is we right-click on that, we head to Properties, and then we head to Tools. And here we will see Error Checking. This option will check the drive for file system errors. Now, take note, it says File System Errors. This will not actually um, fix any... Um, sectors on the disk surface of a hard drive or any um, issues with the workings of an SSD when it comes to the actual mechanical side of it. This is just going to uh, fix file system errors. So just take note of that, which can in some cases uh, prevent slow performance, file corruptions, data loss, and so on. So we click on check. And then yeah, you'll see it says um, you don't need to scan this drive. But if you have a major issue, obviously it will tell you to scan. And then you just click on this link, scan drive. And it says you can keep using the drive during the scan. If errors are found, you can decide if you want to fix them. And just take note though, depending on the size of your drive and the, how much data you've got on your drive, this can take quite a while. So just take note of that. So just go through, the, click on that, um, this link, scan drive, follow the, the um, steps and that should resolve some issues. And something else you can try out um, is you can actually go dive a little bit more deeper and you can also use uh, check disk in command prompt. If you just want another option available, basically it does the same thing. Uh, but if you want to use command prompt, um, then what we do is we head over to our search. If you don't know where command prompt is located, just do a search accordingly by just entering CMD. There we go. And then you right click on it, run it as admin. So you need to run it as administrator or this will not work. And then you um, enter this command, which by the way, is I'll leave the command uh, down below. It's quite a mouthful. So you, I'll leave that in the description so you can just copy and paste. And obviously you replace C with the actual um, drive letter you are scanning. So just take note of that. So if you've got a different uh, drive letter, you need to enter that where you see C in this command shown in this example. And once you've typed that in or copy and pasted that in, you just hit enter. And once again, um, just wait for the process to finish. And then you'll have to restart your computer to apply the changes that have been made if it does pick up any issues. And as mentioned, once again, it may take some time, de time depending on the size of your SSD or your actual hard drive. And once again, just take note though, that um, these two methods I've shown you today um, will not actually fix any physical disk issues. It will only repair file issues if it finds errors and hopefully then will help your performance and prevent data loss, corruption and so on. So I hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.